Corals usually spawn on only one day in the year, but it is not possible to predict exactly what that day is. In many habitats, spawning occurs near the lunar third quarter, but an additional factor is needed to obtain a better prediction. Here we propose a method that may reduce this uncertainty. The basic proposal is that spawning requires the coincidence of two factors. One factor is associated with one lunar rhythm, and for this we will use the synodic rhythm exemplified by the third quarter. For the other factor, we use a lunar rhythm with a different period, the lunar declination. The demonstration here shows that a chosen feature in each rhythm approaches coincidence only every 13 or 14 lunar cycles, that is, about one year. In this diagram, the large circle represents a horizontal view of the Earth. The small black circle represents the third quarter, a feature of the synodic rhythm. The initial position at the base of the diagram indicates the time of the third quarter. When the black circle moves around the Earth back to its original position, this takes 29.53 days and indicates a resumption of the third quarter. The small black square represents the rhythm based on the lunar declination with a period of 27.32 days. The time of the zero declination when the moon is directly over the equator is shown initially at the base of the diagram in a position synchronous with the third quarter. A lunar cycle based on the zero declination is shown moving clockwise around the Earth. Now see what happens when the two symbols are both moving. The black square reaches its original position at 27.32 days, whereas the black circle takes 29.53 days, so that the zero declination is now 2.21 days ahead of the third quarter. If we now see what happens after two more cycles, that is, after three cycles, we see that the zero declination is now 6.63 days ahead of the quarter, that is, 3 times 2.21 days. Correspondingly, when there are 6 cycles, or 9 cycles, the zero declination moves progressively ahead of the quarter. When there are 13 cycles, we find that not only is the zero declination 13 times 2.21 days ahead of the quarter, but it's actually just 0.80 days behind the next quarter. We propose that this may be close enough to trigger the spawning. Finally, after 14 cycles, the zero declination is now 14 times 2.21 days ahead of the quarter. But in the course of doing this, it has overtaken the third quarter and is now only 1.41 days ahead of the quarter. And again, we suggest this interval is close enough to facilitate triggering of the spawning. Observation of actual coral records strongly supports this hypothesis, namely that spawning depends upon the coincidence of two factors. Furthermore, the model also explains a phenomenon occasionally occurring in corals, namely split spawning, that is to say, spawning in two successive cycles.